Hell oh, I am a robot. I have a robot friend. Can you move like a robot? Oh, he's a very floppy robot. Giving you a bit of a clue about our sound today. Robot. Before we learn our new sound, let's have a look at some of the ones that we've already seen. Now these sounds I'm showing you all together. Now we've done them, you know vowel sounds. Sit up very straight, it's a very posh word, very grown up word. Are you ready? Vowels. Your turn. Vowels. That's right. These are short vowel sounds and they're quite important because they come we come across them in nearly every single word so they're very important it's important that we know them so let's see if we can practice our vowel sounds i've got a little song for them at the end so here we go my turn a ah, your turn well done my turn e eh, your turn my turn, I, your turn. Brilliant, well done. My turn, O, your turn. Brilliant, I can see all your O shaped mouths. And our new one, my turn, A, your turn. Fantastic. So, A, E, I, O, A. Okay. A, E, I, O, A. That is how we say them. A, E, I, O, A. That is how we say them. There are five. So you can remember them on your fingers. A, E, I, O, A. That is how we say them. A, E, I, O, A. That is how we say them. They are our vowel sounds. Well done. That's brilliant that you know them. Fantastic. Let's have a look at our star words. I'm going to start today with the word that isn't on a star, the one that we're trying our hardest to recognise. Can you remember? Oh, that was really quick. That was so quick. Well done. My turn and your turn. That was brilliant. Well done. How about this one? Yay. Your turn. My turn. I. I think you probably know this one now as well. Your turn. Well done. My turn. No. I'm going to let you be the teacher again. Are you ready? Your turn. Well done. My turn. Go. And the last one. Are you ready? Your turn. Well done. My turn. Two. I think you're ready for some new star words. That was brilliant. Well done. Fantastic. Okay, so it's time to look at our new sound. And flip the board over. I'm going to see if you can guess the sound first. I've given you some clues. I pretended to be a robot. A robot. Here's my toy robot. And another robot. And I'm going to show you a picture of something that I found in my house this morning. Here it is. Did you see the rainbow? It's coming through the window. I love it when rainbows hit the carpet in my house. Do you have any rainbows that you see in your house? Or do you remember seeing a rainbow out of your window? Or at the moment you'll be seeing lots of rainbows in people's windows and also on the TV. We're thinking about rainbows a lot. So can you guess my sound? Rainbow, robot. Yes, they both start with a r sound. R. Show me an r. Well done. R. My turn. R. Your turn. Brilliant. And it looks like this. So important that we do this one in our rainbow colours. R for rainbow. So here we go. It goes down. Then you go back up the same line. And just before you get to the top, 
you're going to do a curve like a rainbow. There you go. So it goes down, up and over. So we'll have a go in another colour. My pen's a little bit further away, sorry. Here we go, I'm going to try green. And you could do yours in rainbow colours, couldn't you? So we're going to go down, back up that same line. But before you get to the top, curve over for the rainbow. Well done, you're doing that letter brilliantly. I'm going to do one more colour. I'm going to do orange. Here we go. So we're going to go down, up, and over for the rainbow. Brilliant. So my turn. Urr, your turn. Fantastic. Urr for rainbow and urr for robot. Now I've planted some robots around and the robots have found some things beginning with urr. I was wondering if you could help me to spot what the robots have found that begin with an urr. I'll see you in a minute. Okay, I can't see any robots yet, can you? Oh, there's one. A purple robot. And what's this purple robot found? Oh, look. It's found my ring. My ring. Well done, everybody. Let's see if we can spot any more robots. Oh, there's one. Oh, I think he's having a rest. This robot is having a rest with a... What's this? Could it be a dog? Does dog begin with er? No. Could it be a cat? Does cat begin with er? No. I think it must be, judging by these long ears, it must be a... Yes, it's a rabbit. A robot on a rabbit. Well done. Let's see if we can spot any more. Oh, we've already seen you, the robot with the ring. Any more? Oh, it's a red robot. And what's this red robot got? Yes, he's got a pencil. But pencil doesn't begin with er. Pencil begins with a p. Why has this robot chosen that pencil? What colour is it? Yes, well done, it's red. A red robot with a red pencil. Now I think there's one more robot. We've seen you, the robot with the ring. Ah, oh, there's one more. What's this robot got? Oh, this robot has a rod, a fishing rod. And what's the fishing rod got at the end of it. A word beginning with er on a little fish. Let's see if we can sound out this word. Er ag. Er -ag. A rag. A robot with a fishing rod and a word that says rag. Well done. Thank you for helping me find all of the robots with their er objects. Thank you for helping me spot the robots and find out what the robots have discovered around my house. I've got one more game that you could play. It's a game called Robots. So you pretend to be a robot and you have to speak like a robot. So, I'm going to give it a go with you right now. Robots, put your hand on your head. Did you spot my robot talk? I sounded a word out. I wanted you to put your hand on your head. So I sounded out head in my robot voice. Head. Head. Let's try with another one. Okay, robots. Put your finger on your nose. Have you got your finger on your nose? That's what I was saying in my robot voice. 
N O's. Well done. Let's try another one. Put your hand on your egg. Have you got your hand on your egg? Your leg? Me too. Let's try one more. Robots, put your thumb on your N E. Have you got your thumb on your N E, your knee? You have. Well done. That's a game that's really good for listening for sounds in words. And you can play it at home. It's good fun. Sometimes my children play it with me when they're asking for something to eat. Mummy, please can I have some ch ease? And I have to guess the word that they're trying to say. Mummy, please can I have a snack? Mm, that must be a snack. I'd better go and get them some. I'll see you soon. Bye. Oh, before I go and get them the snack, I just had an idea. Perhaps whilst you're practising your ur sound, you could have a go. I'm coming, I won't be a minute. You could have a go at making a rainbow, ur for rainbow, and put it in your window. I know lots of you have already. If you have and you want to try something different, how about making a robot? You could use recyclable materials, bottles, boxes, um, old buttons or lids off of milk tops to make eyes or buttons for a robot. Or draw a robot, use different shapes to make the head and the arms and the legs. If you have a go at a robot or a rainbow, I'd love to see them. I'd better go and get that snack now. See you soon. Thank you for helping me learn. Er, my turn, er, your turn. Okay, I'm coming. Bye.